what is going on ladies and gentlemen it is Corey or Autobot and I'm here today bringing you guys a brand new video today's video guys is you know it is a is an important video um if this is going to be the video that you guys watch and then you know click off after so long please don't watch this video in its entirety because this is a very important subject and I feel like it needs to be said and I want you guys to drop the comments down below and you know just tell me what you think because we received some really big news yesterday regarding the Lincoln Park frontman Chester Bennington. Uh, he was found in this house after a suicide, and you know it leads me to leads me to believe myself that he had some sort of battle that he was fighting. And really, dude, you're just gonna sit in the doorway. Hello, thank you. Oh, yeah, there's two. Yep, yeah, you just sat there, you know, just let them pile up by the door. That's cool, dude. But anyway, um, you know, he was fighting some sort of battle. And, you know, it is fighting a battle, whether it's physical or mental or emotional, isn't easy. You know, physical battles are generally the easier ones to fight. Because, oh, I mean... I fought a lot of physical battles. Hockey's a physical battle, you know, like trying to make yourself in better shape, you know, stuff like that is easier to do because, you know, it's something that will help you better yourself. But in terms of a mental health battle, like a mental battle, it is really tough to fight those. And, you know, I feel like this is something that really isn't looked at a lot because a lot of people especially in the online community, don't really seem to care about people's mental health. And, you know, that's why I'm trying to spread the message of positivity here. Because, I mean, you know, people aren't... I I know I'm not going to be able to change the world with one video, right? You know, changing the world in terms of this stuff is going to take a lot of work. You know, a lot of companies are in on it, or are, are trying to help with mental health and people and, you know, stuff like that. But there isn't a whole lot that can be done. Because, at the end of the day, it's not one person that has to change. It's everyone that does. And, you know, if we can get more people to see what stuff does to people, like what the, the th how the things they say affect people, could, uh, you know, we could, make a, um, we could make a dramatic change in this area. And I want everyone to please, if you guys are watching this, please share this video because I want to get as many people on board with this as I can. And it is a, uh, it is bad because everywhere I go, I see comments on everything. Doesn't matter who it is, I see the kill yourself, you're worthless, you know, you're, no one loves you. you. You know, I see the very, very hurtful and negative comments that, you know, that shouldn't be said. Main, the main one that shouldn't be said is kill yourself because, you know, let's face it, it is very, very bad to say something like that. And on top of that, you know... I've had, I, there's people in my area that have actually killed themselves after being told to kill themselves. And it is a, uh, it is a very big subject for the sole fact that people don't think before they speak. People don't try to think about what type of battles they're going through. I mean, nonetheless, saying kill yourself shouldn't be said at all, but if there's anything that I want you guys to do. If, if you guys are going to comment something, comment something positive. If you guys are going to comment something remotely negative, think about the type of battles that they're going through before you say it. You know, I can, you know, I can live with constructive criticism or, you know, oh, you're bad at this or whatever else, right? I can live with, you know, the minor things under the, on the negative side, but the big things like kill yourself, you're worthless, no one loves you, so on and so forth, should not be said. Especially for the sole fact that people are always undergoing battles. And with people saying something like that, I mean, that could be the difference between them getting off the stool and them just kicking the stool up from underneath them and letting the noose do the rest. So the easiest way that I can put that for you guys is per se, someone's, you know, someone's having a really bad day and, you know, they're being bullied or whatever else and they're fighting a really, really tough battle and they're, they're coming to terms with the fact that they won't, that they can't win this fight. And, you know, they see it as the only option, but, you know, they don't really have, they don't really 
have the uh, the courage to go through with it. And all it would take is that one comment. That's all it would take is that one comment saying to kill yourself and no one loves you or you're worthless or something like that for that person to actually go through with it. You know, that, that one comment is the difference between them being, being alive and them being dead. And it really is sad that People don't think before they speak. People don't think about things like that before they say things. And that's something that should really be taken into consideration, especially when you're saying things like that. It should be taken into consideration before you say anything negative in the first place. But there isn't a whole lot that can be done about it. Because people are just assholes. And unfortunately, you know, I can't make a change. But, you know, I can try to help... The people that are going through the struggles. And, you know, to the people that are that watch my videos that are going through struggles. If you guys are going through a struggle, use the links in the description. Go to me on Twitter. My DMs are open. Shoot me a DM on Twitter. Get in touch with me. I will talk to you. If you guys are going through a battle, I will try to help you. And, you know, if I can't, I want you guys to feel like that you guys have someone to talk to. You know, I, I will always try to help you guys. I will I'll always try to help anyone I can. Because... In my mind, especially in in the times that we live in, positivity is the hardest thing to find. And I want to try I want to try to promote positivity. I want to try to, you know, I want people to feel like people care. And unfortunately, you know, a lot of people don't think before they before they say things, which then leads people to believe that people don't care and then, you know, it just spirals out of control from there and then you have someone Hang, someone hanging from a rope in the room. And, you know, it really it really is upsetting. I mean, there really isn't a lot more that I can say on the subject. Except for the fact that think before you speak. You know, leave the negativity behind and, you know, focus on positivity. It isn't it isn't hard, guys. It isn't hard to avoid typing the three the three letters KYS. Or the three words, kill yourself. It isn't hard to not type those. It's a lot less work to not type them than it is to type them. And if you can take the time to type the words, kill yourself, you could take the time and maybe type something, type something less negative. You know, nothing. You know, nothing along the lines of killing themselves or being worthless. You know, some, something that's not going to affect some that may affect someone's mental health. You know. If you're going to leave something on a video that's not positive feedback, constructive criticism. That is what we need, guys. We don't need negativity. We want positivity. And that is the overall goal here. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. And like I said, guys, if you guys are fighting a battle, get a hold of me on Twitter. I will try to help you guys because that's what I'm here to do. I'm here to help. I'm here to try to make your guys' day better. And... If you guys are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. Click the bell notification so you guys always get notified when I upload. And that's it for this video, guys. It's been your boy Corey, or Autobot, and I'm out. Peace.